I'm Gerald Romer. I am the auto body and paint instructor here at Hartford Tech. And this is the classroom. This is where we do a lot of the cognitive learning and procedures. We have in the corner, we have a machine that we do graphic printing, that we print decals and stickers. So we use the graphics we lay down and we use it to paint over or to stencil around. Students have their own carts. They get their own toolboxes, different size toolboxes. All depends on what we're doing. We do airbrushing. Students learn how to airbrush in the painting. There's some of the pictures that the students airbrushed with the stencil. We have a frame machine that we learn how to straighten in frames when they're damaged in collision. Under the canvas here is a laser 3D measuring alignment system that we use. We learn to set up and it tells us how to square a frame and where, the, where it's possibly bent. As we move into the shop, we have multiple welding stations around. We have a resistance welder. We have oxygen acetylene. We have our paint booth where we paint. It's a full paint booth. It's heated. We have our paint mixing room, paint guns, our material room, tool room. And we do all types of projects. This is where the students were doing some airbrushing. We will be getting a new piece of equipment this year. It's a simulator for the auto paint shop. It's a virtual reality paint simulator. So that's something that's coming. This is the inside of the paint booth where we have multiple different projects. Students from painting fenders to where they welded horseshoes together. Have another student that was working on a wooden project and he was clear coating the wood panels for his project. These are some Jeep doors that are in here that the students painted for a uh, teacher's Jeep. So we do all types of different product projects in here. This is a forklift that the students will end up painting. We're going to paint it uh, yellow and black, put the original letters back on it, and we're going to put some Tech Cobra and some Harford Tech stickers on it, make it black and yellow, make it authentic. Hello, my name is Gerald Romer. I am the auto collision and paint refinish instructor at Harford Tech. My email address is gerald.romer at hcps.org. If you need anything, that's where you can reach me at. In freshman year, you learn about estimating, how to handwrite an estimate. We use CCC1 estimating equipment, which is linked to industry. You learn about tools, proper maintenance on tools, lights, bumpers, interior trim panel, how to remove them properly and reinstall them. There is a rotation for the FOT class that the students travel to different tech areas to see where and how other tech areas operate. You will also learn an overview of the infrastructure of a body shop, insurance companies, claims, offices, how to set up a body shop, how to run your own shop, and how to be successful in the auto collision industry. In your sophomore year, you learn about lifts, tire balancers, mount and balance time tires, front end alignments, proper way to handle the equipment and how to store the equipment. You will learn about stationary glass, removable glass, and bolt on body parts fenders, doors, hoods, trunk lids, etc. In junior year, you learn about metal repair, hammer and dolly on sheet metal, how to pull dents out of metal. You learn body filler repair, where you put the body filler over top the hammer and dolly area. Then you learn about glazing, where you, that goes over small dings and dents and over top of body filler. You learn plastic bumper repair, plastic bumper welding, you learn oxygen and acetylene welding as well as MIG welding. You learn how to remove welding on body panels 
and reinstall the welder on body panels using the skills from welding and body filler repair. You also learn frame measuring and how to set up a frame machine and the frame measuring equipment. In the senior year, you learn about auto paint spray equipment, how to take your paint guns apart, how to clean them, how to properly store them. You learn about panel prepping, priming and repairing panels. You learn how to apply base coat and clear coat. If there's any imperfections in the final finish, you learn how to water sand and buff and final detailing to present the job. Job opportunities in this trade consist of an estimator where you can write estimates for the insurance companies or for the body shop, painter where you can be a painter in the collision industry or other industries of painting, a collision repair technician where you repair vehicles that have been in an accident or fabricate or restoration work, fabricators where you weld and construct things, welders you learn how to weld in this trade, working in the parts department, researching, looking up parts numbers for vehicles and parts that are needed to repair the vehicle. You can venture out and be your own shop owner. You can be an insurance appraiser. Some of the things that can happen in your junior and senior year, apprenticeship, work learning program, skills, certification and in industry, rec industry recognition, and trade schools. Some of the most common questions, how does my child get in? You would contact Jeannie Donnelly at hcps.org and she will walk you through the process to apply for Hartford Tech. Can my child work on his own car? Yes, as long as it aligns with the curriculum or the standard operating procedures that we were teaching at the time. Will my child be working on customer cars? Yes, we do take in other students, teachers, and outside customer cars to be worked on. Will my child need to buy their own tools? No, they will not. The school supplies all tools necessary to work on these vehicles. What your child will need is uniform, safety glass, safety boots. Who do I talk to about my child getting in? Jeannie Donlick at hcps.org listed right below. Thank you. Thank you for viewing my tech area. I hope you enjoyed it and maybe I'll see you soon.